Hello everybody and welcome to this year's announcement video for the Boss Rush Jam. Currently we're sitting at 700 participants that have already signed up for the jam and I can only imagine that number is going to either double or significantly increase in the next couple of days, which is wild folks. <laughs> a few things we have to cover in this video, one of them being the awards and uh, prizes that are going to be given away during this jam. We have some inspirational words for our from our jams creator about boss rushes. And finally, we got to reveal the theme or you guys won't know what to do. But first, I want to thank one of this year's jams sponsors, plusmusic.ai. Plus Music is a plugin for Unity and Unreal. It uses an AI-based music platform that gives developers access to a library of more than 100,000 songs from indie artists. It has a built-in music editor which adds the soundtrack directly into your game, and in just a few clicks, you can get amazing personalized and affordable music with this plugin. And for musicians out there that are looking to get in contact with Plus Music about using their music, feel free to reach out to them by either filling out a submit music form at plusmusic.ai or joining the artist's channel in their Discord server. The link will be in the description down below. Two hours from now, we're gonna be sending out emails to all of you who have already joined the jam with links so you can set up your three month subscriptions. Uh, if you're late joining the jam, head over to the Plus Music Discord server and get your link there. If you would like to leave feedback for the Plus for Plus Music, you can do it in their Discord server or you can leave it on the email you're gonna get after registering on their platform. Thank you again to Plus Music for finding us and sponsoring our jam. With that being said, we're gonna hop into the prizes now because three lucky winners handpicked among the top 20 in the community vote are gonna be recipients of cash money prizes. That's right, three lucky winners. <clears throat> Prizes are as follows. Third place is gonna be receiving 200 US dollars. Second place is gonna be getting 300 US dollars. And first place is going to be getting a whoppy, whopping, whoppy, whoppy, 500 US dollars. But that's not all folks. Plus Music is also providing the jam with two new awards and also giving the top three winners uh, something a little extra special. First of all, the best use of Plus Music Award, which is going to be a $200 award to the person or team that uses that it best uses the Plus Music plugin. There's a lot of P's in that. And secondly, the team that uses or utilizes or makes their wants to use their original soundtrack, wants to make an original soundtrack, the overall best soundtrack award, which is also another $200 provided by Plus Music. Finally, the top three winners that we mentioned earlier, the first, third, the first, third, and second place winners will also be receiving a year-long Plus Music license for their games, allowing the teams to develop it even further. Now that we've gone over all the awesome prizes, I just want to take a moment, take a, take a step back, and I want to talk about our love for Boss Rush games. Uh, and for those of you who are watching this video that are like, what the heck is a Boss Rush? This segment's just for you. We have the creator of the Boss Rush Jam that is going to take a few moments just to explain why he loves boss rushes and what the heck they are. Take it away, Fartfish. Hey everyone, I'm Adam, but you probably know me as Fartfish, and I love boss rushes. For those of you who don't know, a boss rush is basically a game where there's absolutely no in-between. It's just bosses. There might be some upgrades, maybe some shops, so on and so forth, but ultimately, boss rushes are about bosses. You fight one, kill it, and move on to the next one. Some games take the path of slapping one after another, such as Wizard of Legends boss rush game mode, while others simply place the player into a hub where they have immediate access to every boss, such as Titan Souls. Some even do both, like Hollow Knight's Pantheon. Ultimately, the best part of boss rushes are captivating boss fights and intense battles, and I look forward to playing your games. All right, all right, all right. I know you want to hear what the theme for the jam is, so we've gone over the details, we've gone over prizes, we've gone over sponsors, and we showed, you know, a little soft side, showing you and sharing with you what we love of Boss Rushes and why we want this jam to be so successful. So, the theme for the Boss Rush Jam of 2023 is... Makeshift. Wait, what's makeshift? Uh, what does it mean to be makeshift? Uh, makeshift is, uh, something that's usually hastily made with a mishmash of items or materials that the person has immediate access to. Uh, some questions you might ask during your brainstorming might be like, what does it mean to make something makeshift? Or what in the game could be makeshift? Uh, keep in mind that anything can be makeshift. It could be the player, it could be the boss, it could be weapons, it could be the environment itself. Um, honestly, interpret makeshift however you want. Maybe it's something that needs to be made quickly in the midst of battle. Maybe it's something of poor quality that easily breaks. Heck, it could be uh, something else, anything, honestly. Who knows? Well, you do, because you guys are the ones making the games. So if you have any other further questions, leave them in the description, leave them in the comments down below. All the information and links that you need to access this jam will be in the description down below. So go check the description. And guys, good luck, have fun, 
and we look forward to playing your games. Bye-bye.